thinking hard about his choice, wondering if Abel is the right choice. The grand finals will be three out of five, three out of five games. Evolution 2009. Feet and cheering. I think Justin has proven he's one of the very strongest players in the United States. Justin really the is strongest. He is. He's uh, he's shown incredible strength here. I think really a dominating Street Fighter Four performance thus far. Daigo looking very calm. Uh, Daigo is also shown that he's uh, really on another level. He's not, we already saw this matchup once, but this is what everybody on the internet predicted would be a Street Fighter 4 Finals, and it played out and it's, exactly it's that right way. out of the textbook. Justin will be on the left playing Abel. Daigo and Mahara on the right with Rue. And again, feeling each other out. Daigo looks like he's developed some new technologies from last match. This is it, the Grand Finals. Maybe he's been talking to Dan. He's representing with that crouching strong punch to try and check that standing forward from Justin. Justin makes an adjustment with Low Roundhouse, but quickly eats Daigo's counter. Low Roundhouse with uh, Abel is not as fast as he might like it, but you can combo it into that roll to cancel some of the recovery. And again, that low strong from Daigo. And you can see uh, his incredible ability to link not only Fireball off that low strong, but really anything, including Super. Justin Wong does need to win two sets to uh, take this Evolution Championship. He was placed under the losers back by Daigo Umehara. It's quite the mountain to climb. Yeah. Three he out of five. Really has not made a dent in Umehara yet. Mount uh, Daigo. Justin's climbing Mount Daigo. Let's see if he makes it to the top. A little surprise uh, wheel kick there, uh, and again, trying to keep Daigo on his feet. But uh, Daigo, again, completely stable here. Again, this is a really high tension match. It's not the uh, pyrotechnics style of Street Fighter. It's really a chess match here. Both players trying to feel each other out, understanding their exact ranges, dancing in and out of the ideal range to be at. That's a nice check. It's very hard to react to. Oh, Daigo, very fast reactions there. Flick. Punishes with the low forward fireball. Focus cancel into low forward Tatsu. Daigo still showing control over this match. I'm not sure why Justin uh, feels he can win it. He really is looking very comfortable. Uh, we'll see if, Di if uh, Justin can turn it around. But he's going to need to make something happen. He does have the ultra meter to make something happen. Wow, Justin, very respectful there. Again, waiting for the Shoryu from Daigo. It doesn't come. So he could have go, gone for the throw. He didn't. And again, Justin might need to show a little more aggression here if he wants to take out the champ. Try and rattle him a little. I have not seen this kind of support for Justin Wong at an Evolution Finals ever, really, even versus Japan. Uh, I, well, you know, I think that's one of the reasons why Justin has been playing Rufus recently. He said that he likes to put on a show for the crowd now, but right now it's all business versus a player like Daigo. He doesn't want to take any risks with a oh, character no. like Rufus. Daigo with a great bait there. Knew that uh, Justin would want to try and grab him with the uh, EX Tornado spin. Jumped right up and landed a massive combo into Super. Daigo again, one of the hallmarks of his Rue is that he's not willing to throw out a lot of uh, EX fireballs. Oh, nice. EX change of direction. Oh, no. A rare miss. Can't it's afford hard to, to land that. that ultra in the corner. I think he uh, neglected to, to uh, do something up. Uh, but maybe uh, just a slight brain fart. He didn't know what he wanted. That is uh, a critical mistake, and Justin cannot be happy about that. And we'll see this may. Justin may make a change in adjustment here. Justin's team yelling for him to switch. Chancing for him to switch, yeah. And he is, he's going back to the Rufus. I think his secret plan oh, against Daigo is not working out. Daigo survived the onslaught. I know he's been considering picking Sagat. I know he's been considering picking Sagat wow. in this fight against Daigo. Yes. Maybe right now he's not bald. Maybe right now he's I do not feel him. listening to the crowd is a strong play. Justin feels happy about Balrog. Balrog is not got Two more chances to try things out. Two more chances here, but he's got to make something happen soon. He's already down one set in this three out of five match. Looks like he's losing a little bit of confidence and uh, trying to go now. real deep into the character selection bag right now. Justin now representing the U.S. with uh, Balrog, the boxer, and his U.S. Uh, Stars and Stripes outfit. He does not play a lot of Balrog, but his Balrog is uh, low slouch. I do believe he uh, qualified for uh, FBO with his character, so you know he, he, does, he does train with Balrog as well. A lot more success so far, and again, Balrog not as popular in Japan as I think he is in the U.S. Oh no, oh, that's the crumple, and he's going to eat the combo. Right oh, again, clutch uppercut from uh, Umahara. You can't just jump in for free. 
Doesn't do too much damage, but definitely uh, a game changer there. Dashed in, now he's got Balrog in the corner, and Daigo feels very comfortable poking with that low forward there. But one of the things about Boxer is his low roundhouse is one of the best sweeps in the game, one of the fastest so pokes. Fast. Very difficult to punish, if not impossible from some ranges. No guard here in this game either. That's he right. He's to block for a while sometimes. Oh, he bases an Umi Shoryu. Oh, but misses the combo, and the crowd does not like that. Oh, that's a stand for his check. Chanting. USA! They want to see Justin do some damage here. Crowd chanting USA. Crowd dies down a little bit. As soon as the action starts, they are uh, as into this as we are. Oh, there it goes. They're cheering on every hit. Now. Wow, the connects a super. All right, Umahara has his work cut out for him if he wants to come back in this one. Oh, no. Missed an uppercut. Unless that was a very advanced form of bait that Justin didn't take. Yeah. Oh, the trades. Justin feeling good. That's one match apiece. People are on their feet. The energy is electric. Oh, he lands that jumping combo again. Justin got, you. Justin's got a very solid mix-up game with this ball rock right now. I'm impressed. He is, he's playing uh, not quite. The, oh. There it is again. Oh, oh another rare ref from Blackie. And that is the ultra. It's going to be round one to Justin. Another round one to Justin. He is getting hurt. Right now, he is in the loser's bracket. He has got a lot of rounds to come back. But the crowd is uh, really happy to see him coming back right now. And Daigo, again, going for that knockdown, willing to use the meter there to land the knockdown, but doesn't really follow it on with a lot of strong pressure. Justin really putting on display a mastery of Balrog's normals, just like he does with Rufus, showing you that, hey, these basics really matter, everybody. He gets caught by the uh, EX, or the crossover spin kick there. And again, there's the footsies, nice dash in throw attempt, but Daigo is uh, on top of that one. It's a stand roundhouse check at a distance. Dancing, really great. Him dancing. Very nice. I like that. Ooh. That is some juicy stuff. Right outside of the foot. Yeah. Real yeah. artistry. Yeah. Oh, this could be bad. Yeah. Oh, damn it, but gonna put him in the corner. So it's about even. You still got that full super meter. We saw him use it before. Oh, no. Oh, I think that's not gonna be good. It's not gonna kill him either, but it's close. It's a lot. Justin landing everything, really making the Justin most of the meter. Justin's gotta watch out for that who may show you. Rue is queued up. Daigo does have uh, room for an uh, uppercut into... Focus cancel Justin into Ultra. Doesn't want to fall into a rhythm and let Daigo land that Ume Harsh, are you? Oh, this swimming? is some incredible I stuff. Like, I don't like him swinging so much. I don't like it. I don't like it. Daigo really trying to grind him out here. Oh, I don't know about that. Yes. And that is the second round and the second game for Justin Wong. That is the second round and the second game for Justin Wong. We're about to get on a run here. They're starting yeah. to take down the stanchions. Yeah, they're coming through our ropes. This is like a zombie invasion. They're coming right through the fences. The fires have been destroyed. Evolution is about to fall apart right now with these grand finals. Let's go! Let's go, Justin. Let's go. That's what the crowd is chanting here behind us. And Justin is really putting uh, Daigo under a lot of pressure. And, uh, oh, there it is again. That level two focus when Justin tries to sweep. The stars and stripes on Boxer. Daigo doesn't look ready for this. I don't I don't know if he doesn't have the experience against Boxer. Again, Boxer, extremely popular character in America. Not as much in Japan. There are definitely some strong boxers in Japan. I don't, I don't know why Daigo's not ready for him. Yeah, I, see him see. I agree, I agree. He's an arcade original character. Daigo has plenty of experience in the arcade, possibly more than almost anybody in the world. Wow, really nice jump back with that fireball. It was right on the edge of his foot. Yeah, uh, just dodged out of there again. Sweeping. Wow. Oh, oh no! Umehara! Oh no, he's not dead, he's not dead yet. yet. He's not dead yet. Oh, he jumps right out of there. Can Justin pull off a little miracle here? What's Justin looking for. This is the ground final. Oh! I think. What do you think he was going for there? I 
saw Justin exhale as he got hit. I think he was going for a turn punch, maybe. Trying to go oh, down there. turn punch. That would have been about the only thing I could I'm think. He sure. couldn't focus through it. He yeah, couldn't focus I'm in the ultra. Sure. It looked like maybe he was just throwing jabs to try to bait a fireball, but the fireball came really too fast. Oh, I don't know what yeah. Tense, tense match. And Umahara showing that he's here to play. Walk up Dragon Punch, putting himself right in the first position, Umahara. Never to be counted out. That is one of the beast's greatest abilities. He's always uh, a threat. Now Daigo's showing that level two focus. He's taking away the threat of Justin Sweep, so he's able to uh, capitalize and dash in a little bit more. Very nice. It was extremely nice, but being in the corner against Balrog is absolutely not where you want to be. His great foot speed and extreme sweep ability. And a jab into throw. We haven't seen a lot of throws because Daigo's been proving so great at tackling. Spacing is ridiculous. Right now, yeah. Daigo's got two meters. Justin does not want to cling recklessly because he knows Daigo will have to up. Standing jab. Justin walking around. Justin walking away. Justin Wong standing up, looking to get a little bit of hype from the crowd. He needs it. He has never defeated Daigo before, but right now he wants it back. Justin actually walked away in the middle of the round and had to come back in a hurry to his stick. He wasn't even charged to do a special at the beginning of the round. Justin's feeling his own hype. Uh, really, uh, maybe a little over eager here. And he's playing a very basic ball oh, ball here. That's is. amazing because he was beaten by the basics last time he fought Daigo. So uh, to play a basic ball rog and uh, be taking the game back from Daigo, that would really boost his confidence. That's right. He's really uh, feeling his oats here. And looking beautiful. Oh, giant combo. That's a classic combo. Oh, and a rare mistake from Daigo, from Justin there. And Daigo answers back. Now Justin thinks maybe he cheered a little too soon. 2-2, two, two. Justin must win this next game to advance to a second set. Dago Otherwise, takes it. Dago Mahara is your Evolution 2009. Justin sticks his ball off. Champion. Doesn't like Rufus versus Shoto. Whoever wins this could be your first world champion. That's true, the first true world champion in Street Fighter 4. Yeah, we can call them the world champion because they beat me in a tournament. And uh, <laughs> we're calming down here. The crowd is almost silent with anticipation. Standing around house check. You New Yorkers shout for their boy. Every, everybody is uh, on the edge of their seats, feeling every hit. Just as hard as his competitors. And that's, oh, he no, doesn't go for the ultra. He wanted to save it. I think he did, he might want to save, save it. It's safe. It's safe. It's safe. Yes. And again, those air it. counters. Very nice. And Ume, or, uh, Umehara now jumping backwards, creating some space. Nice sweep there. Oh, that was the focus cancel. Safe uppercut. Uh-oh, this is I dangerous. Know. Oh, cross up block. Very nice counter by Justin. Round one to Justin. If he can take the second one, he'll reset the series. A big jumping hard punch. Great air normal. That's so fast. Characters get off the ground really fast in this game. You can sometimes just jump back and counter things that look like they're right on top of you. That jump fierce air to air is ball, one of Barron's best air to air moves. And it's a lot of damage, too. Daigo answering back here, but it's still anybody's game. Oh, standing jab. That's something new for Daigo. Daigo adapting again on the fly to let the, uh, that's the legacy of a great, great player. They're able to adapt within the pressure of the match they're playing. Justin swinging those low roundhouses. I hope he doesn't need another level two focus. It's true. Justin really looks shut down so far this round. Not making it happen. And Daigo content to just throw those low forward fireballs from the perfect space. Yeah, Justin wants to play the aggressor this round and seal it away, but uh, it doesn't look like it's working for him. Maybe he's going to have to go back to that slow, patient, methodical style that was winning it for him in the past. But he does have Daigo in the corner, which is exactly where he wants him. But not a lot of life to do his mix-ups. Oh, Justin a little hungry there, uh, showing his hand and runs into now, a fireball. Now the next round starts with this both is players it. in full super bar. Both players full, full super bar. bar. Round dangerous. three, Evolution 2009. It's all on the line right now for Justin Wong. Can he hold it down for America? Championship point for Daigo, the beast Omehara right now. Daigo wins this. He is your Evolution champion and world champion of Street Fighter 4. Justin wins. He advances it to one last set to try and steal it from Daigo. I like that standing jab. Very smart adjustment from Daigo. Oh, there's the super. Oh, no. Blocked. The crowd likes what that is going one. on? The Justin Wong. Oh, there is again that trouble right afterwards. Yeah. Oh, rare yeah. miss. What is going on? Daigo's eyes oh, got wide after corner. he missed that one. Managed Justin. Oh, oh I'm sure you're right that there. Miss. Daigo's here to play. Oh, no. Angry. Daigo's all over him. Oh, oh, overhead. Oh, Justin's now hungry, and Justin Daigo's putting in the pressure. Justin doesn't want to use those four meters. Maybe it's time for him to use some of those EXs to go through those fireballs. Oh. I don't know. There's the throw. What's it's going to come right down. Is he going to go for all yeah. Oh, my God. Justin, oh. 
That is not the championship, that is only a new set. And security is gonna have to be called to immediately clear the stage. Out of control. Out of control, and uh, Justin hasn't even won. The race not even over yet. Justin just won one set, there's the piece. And everyone's doing crazy. Our staff is clearing the stage, but the, the action is continuing. The set is cleared. It's 0-0 zero, zero again. We play a fresh set. Daigo's going to knock the losers by right Justin now, Long. It's the first of three wins. Whoever wins is a champion. Justin Long surprisingly able to take Daigo back down to the championship set. Whoever wins first three fights is going to be our Evolution 2004 Street Fighter 4 World Champion. First one ever. 2009. 2009. 2004 was the original Ultra Battle. <laughs> Could have ended in a moment. Sorry, folks. And then it got extended for another I whole set. Uh -huh. Everybody some here. Incredible moments already. Excuse me while uh, during my absence and doing a little crowd control. <laughs> yes. Uh, some friendly, friendly encouragement to uh, have everybody step back. We're now to our last three cough drops. We love the energy in the room, but we gotta we make sure we don't interfere with the players on the stage. Good thing this one can't go another set. We don't have any uh, cough drops left. Our voices are gone. Uh, we're almost running out of matches here at Evolution 2009. Uh, our math indicates we've played well over 50,000 matches of fighting games here this oh weekend. My God. And it's come to this epic conclusion. The Street Fighter 4, two legendary champions now facing off against each other for the first world title champion. Justin Long. Wow. Nice charging on that, very fast. Justin Wong on the left, Daigo the beast doing the horror on the right. Oh. It is the grand final. Daigo catches him with that. There are prices to be paid for throwing out that standing roundhouse, and Daigo shows in glorious fashion what those are. Now Daigo rushes down. still got a four ultra. Wow. Looking Game one, that, Daigo. Looking for that head, but he was a little bit antsy. He really wanted to land that ultra. I hope Justin hasn't gone too far here. And, uh, no Daigo now. Sometimes those big uh, emotional victories, you can go on a high and then crash a little bit afterwards. Yeah. So Justin really needs to look deep That's inside why he now. Needs five hour energy because you get no crash. Yeah, I hope he hasn't blown his load just yet. He's still <laughs> got a, a lot of fights left right here. Oh, I think he could have been able to punish that uh, low roundhouse with Daigo. Really? Justin literally looking for his fight money and Daigo looking for the pride of the country. That's right. And, uh, just like the characters on screen. Wow. A lot of very delicate spacing. Wow. No uppercut there from Daigo. There on this. He had Justin get a full combo. And Justin looking strongly in control. Look at him float over those fireballs. EX rush. Rushes. Oh, there again, that standing roundhouse. He pays a big price. I like that by Daigo. Yeah, adjustment by Daigo showing uh, you can't just throw it out of me for free. But a nice answer by Justin here in round one of the second game. It's rare to see Daigo not learn something quick, but he keeps trying those jump-ins. He keeps getting tagged with that low fierce. Well, those jump-ins have paid off against the roundhouse, though. So, uh, you know, oh, very nice. Oh, but it doesn't catch. Uh, impressed with the play, but now he's out of the meter. Yes. Wow. Daigo really at home throwing fireballs in your face. He's been master show to play for many years. And there's that ultra. Should be ruined about 50%. Toss up by Daigo also. Oh, they're a miss. He wants to save that meter. He realized he had already done a jab short. He didn't have a lot of charge. So he wants to save that meter and get some big damage off of it. And that might not have been the best decision. Umehara. Overhead. Look at that brilliant last second block yeah, by Daigo. Yeah, that was the first one Justin's shown all this time, but Daigo was still ready for it. And that shows the uh, the mind of a champion waiting to see whether it was going to be a low rush and blocking that, and then standing up at the very last possible second. Uh, reactions can play a big role here. Wow. Daigo trying to focus, and that's going to be the end. Justin Wong takes game two. That is one game apiece. I think this is incredible. Uh, this, is, this is the matchup everyone was hoping to see, and it is really an incredible turn. Oh, we'll make sure you both players playing at an exceptional level, too. Oh, my God, that was great. Such an amazing footsie sweep. Perfect footsie. It's the little things sometimes that send you over the edge here.
I know, a lot of spacing, brilliant spacing from both these players. Daigo also known for his great spacing and looking for the right opportunities to get the low forward fireball and backing up a tiny bit more to land a blank fireball with no uh, normal move setup. Really just brilliant play. Jumping there to see if you can catch him in a rush punch. Not happening. Nice walk up and throw. Not a lot of throw attempts here. Both players have a lot of respect for the attacking ability. Oh, yeah. The new jockey is going to go for a throw or a throw attack. That's a patent to Daigo special. John Troy uses it a lot too. You set up a throw and then you can walk in and go for that Shoryu because uh, it's safe if it's blocked after you focus cancel it. Oh. Daigo has yet to go for a level 3 focus there. Oh wow, big answer for that throw attempt. Here's Shoryu. Oh, so nice from Daigo. Nice, nice adjustment there. And he's uh, playing a lot more aggressively this round. And Justin's paid the price for it so far. Oh, very nice. He wants to close out uh, game two. Wow, Justin answers back and will even up the score on the life bar. It is 1-1. One, one. It is 1-1 one, one, and uh, round one to Daigo. Again, Daigo Umehara playing Rue. Justin playing Balrog with the All-American. Oh, blows the meter there just to be safe on the shorty. Overhead, very smart. Wow, oh no. A big opportunity. Balrog has no cross up move. If you walk underneath him, he cannot miss that dip jab hook. He did. Justin had a chance there to connect a big combo and did not connect it. That's 2-1 Daigo. and did not connect it. That's 2-1 Daigo. Championship point again for Daigo Umehara. Justin, no stranger to pressure. Justin has to win the next two games. Will take incredible composure to stay strong through this, not only this uh, match, but this entire weekend. Has been a grind. Justin's already been a big competitor in some high-profile matches earlier today. Looks like yeah, now getting it out against the champion's pan. Looks like Justin might have just gotten wise to the uh, repeated focus actions that Daigo was using, and now he's throwing in some of those armor packers. Again, both uh, both players representing. That's what you gotta do. You gotta say, if you're willing to... Oh, no, Uma you into Ultra. He is never afraid to throw out that deep, that uh, uppercut at these range. Daigo Umahara with two meters and an Ultra is perhaps the most dangerous man in Street Fighter Four. Uh, you can walk in anywhere and go for that. Oh, look at that. Throw fake. Oh, is he you? That is ridiculous. Daigo now turning it up a level. I didn't think there was anything more in it, but that was definitely up a notch. Bam! Walk up show. Unbelievable. When you think they can't turn it up anymore, they do. Wow, look at Daigo almost appears to be clowning around. Look what this is. This. I think he's, uh, he's, that's the most focused attack I've seen from him all day. Well, he knows that Justin is not using those armor breaks, but he's just exploiting that fact. And uh, maybe he's looking for a counter level 2 crumble uh, to a rush punch. Because we don't see Justin doing a lot of taps. It's an amazing adjustment here by Daigo. Wow. Cool combo. Daigo is all over him, although the life bar, he's actually got an advantage. Nice. Dances in for the throw. You're not gonna get a lot of those. Oh, counters, reversal, uppercut. Nice jump away, and he catches Daigo baiting. I think Daigo might have tried the uppercut there. And Justin must win this round in order to stay alive. That's right. And tie up the set. Incredible tension, Justin does have a full super meter. Daigo does have two meters though. Oh, there's the combo. Good way to start. Very nice from Justin, 50% for Daigo. Oh, with. Ah, that's gotta hurt. Cross up, nice block. Oh, throw it to. Oh, nice counter throw there. He's gonna avoid his uh, pressure game with Daigo. Now he's able to take his uh, distance again. He's sitting on about a 20% life lead. And Daigo with those very fast dashes up in uh, Justin's face, able to land a throw. Jumping in with strong to avoid certain counters. That will avoid the jump away counters. Now throwing him said. I found a weakness in your game. Threatening that EX Tatsu, which you can land an ultra afterwards. Oh, nice. Oh, no. more. I know, he had an opportunity to do more, but uh, was unable to land it there. A lot of pressure again on these guys. Even Steven, the matches come right down to the wire, the whole tournament. Over a thousand competitors, and all coming down to this final few blows. Oh, very, just barely out of range. Daigo showing willingness to throw out some meter there, just to create the right Oh, no, he missed it, but he's still connected. Will he connect? 
Justin Long, ladies and gentlemen. This is unbelievable. That's 2-2, it's going to the final game. Final game of the final set of the final, final, final. It could not have gone any better than this. This yeah. is a picture moment. We are down to the wire, baby. It's Evolution 2009, Street Fighter 4 Grand Final. Justin Set Long is on the ball, bro. And I got the beast on my heart on the right. And the championship point to read the playoff. Get hype, baby. Are you freaking out? I'm freaking out. Justin Long with the surprise with the ball, bro. He's deserving very well against I go in heart, who doesn't seem to be ready for the safe defensive play. Justin looking very confident. And again, checking those throw attempts from Daigo now. I don't know what's going to happen. Yeah, Justin wins. I'm afraid even to speak in some situations. Both of them just feeling each other out. Justin wins. I'm going crazy. I'm going to let you guys know right now. Fair way. Like, carts are racing this entire room. Who made sure you dash and throw? That's an easy tech. Justin made sure a little sweating a little bit. Doesn't want to lose this. Nice throw yeah, tag. Justin won that last round. Of, uh, There's the anti-air uh, counter. A few, uh, few uh, not really clean gun combos there, but composure had man managed to carry through and let him hit that rocket combo. Yeah, uh, maybe he's thinking about that. Really some championship level play. And uh, he's going to need to make something happen here, though, in this round. Uh, Daigo seems content to sit on his lead. Oh, nice oh, throw attempt. Daigo's reactions on And there is where reactions pay off. That uh, whiff rush recovers almost instantly. But uh, Daigo not only able to react, but react with a low forward uppercut. Match point Daigo. Match point Champion Daigo. Point, Daigo. Champion Championship of the world point. Yeah. Evolution 2009, it all comes to this. Justin fighting for his life and doing very well so far. Justin oh no. Justin has got a hard time baiting out anything from Daigo. Daigo's reactions are so good that he can't make him dragon punch when he wants him to. Oh, big range on that throw. Justin might have been throwing something out. Oh no, oh, Daigo like guesses right again. Yeah. Right in his face. Throw. EX. Rush punch. Oh, now Daigo threatening again with those focus attacks. Commentator talking directly to the players now. Oh no, it's all gonna come right down to this. Daigo, oh, Daigo Omahara takes it. And Justin must admit that was an excellent match and the crowd is on its feet. Daigo. Evolution 2009, Daigo Omahara, the Japanese legend has returned to face his perennial American opponent, Justin Wong. That was just an incredible, incredible showing. Uh, my vocal cords are blown. My mind is blown. It could not have been a more picture for the moment. And there he is, Daigo with a big smile for the crowd. He's feeling it. An incredible weekend, an incredible show comes to an end with Daigo Mehara leaving as the world champion of Street Fighter IV. And that is a title we hope he'll be back to defend next year. Uh, I, I am not even prepared to think about next year. So much to say about everything that's happened here today. What do you want to say? Uh, my mind is swimming. My mind is swimming. I think we, we saw it. We can go swimming if you want. Get out of the pool if you come on. Turn it up.